Started for us, well, for our YouTube channel. Um, so hopefully we'll get some good stuff. But we don't want to repeat of last time. There were so many crayfish. So hopefully it's going to be a really good video. And hopefully Little Mac may get a gun again, or something even better. So hope you enjoy. Got a hook. So here we go. Got a piece of the bridge. What you got, mate? Camera there. So that's it, little Max just had the first knife for the day. What is it? Flick knife, innit? Hold on, should we see if it still works? Yeah, yeah it's got gungy stuff on. I'll grab it. <laughs> oh, there we go. So there we go, it's still working. Oh, little Max kicking the camera out. That's what we've got. Oh, what little Max got again. What is it? Combat UK, I think it is, says. There we go. It's nice, that is. So we all found a coin purse with a set of keys attached to it. It's got a penguin on. So we are another scaffold pole, but I've never had one like this before. <laughs> Where it's double on the end. There we are, piece of a road sign. Controlly of the day. Well, half. But he's, very, he's found a very long bar, actually. That's a it's fence, a fence spike. Fence spike, yeah. It's more of a fence spike, I mean, look. It's a spike. I'm not sure what that is. I'm not quite sure. Plastic, though, so with a little bit of metal on, but not much. He's found a. What is it again, Kens? Which one is it? Uh, a runner. He's found a little rally bike. Last time we were down here, we found a rally bike and all. Yeah. Very good. There we go. Got a velo bike seat. <laughs> there we are, got a nice lump hammer. Might keep that one actually, it's alright that. Alright, so little Max done it again. These nice little beer mechs. To be fair, I might end up taking that one home just because we want their mag wheels off there. The old plastic wheels. What do you think, Ken's? What do you reckon? <laughs> He's done it again. Second bike. Very nice. I'm not sure what that is. It's sealed, of course, but I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. It's got a... I think... I think it's something God related there. It's got somebody inside, but I'm not sure which one it is. That's different. When Wiggly metal. Wiggly metal. Wiggly. Yeah, right. So found a little sort of hideaway and I've now figured out that a load of magnet fish whoever has been down here, they've been dumping all the scrap in there. So I'm pulling all that out now, but also that was right in front of it. So be very, very careful when you're out and about magnet fishing or even just walking around. Make sure you don't get them stuck in your feet because that cap wasn't even on it. Right, we're gonna move location now because, well, we don't want to be around any needles. I've moved as many of them as I can. Left the scrap over the side in a pile. I'm just going to send a picture to my scrap man now. Show him the location so we get picked up. Uh, yeah, so now we're going to move that way. That way. Then what you got there? I found a nail, but it looks like a square one. It's a square nail. So it is an old nail. Yeah, square one. It's an old nail. Then see what else you can find. So we are, we moved on again. See what we get. Very quickly. Just pulled some random stuff out of the water. And then we've got a fish, we caught a fish magnet fishing. <laughs> so there's a yo-yo. Uh, there is a pair of headphones and some other random bits. Another decorative piece of metal. And 
found a safe key. I found a safe it's key. not a safe key. It's a big key, though. Yeah. It's a safe key. It is. Yeah, it is. Yeah. I hope you have an, um, good. <laughs> Try that again. I forgot. Try again. Thanks for watching. So there we go. That's the end of the day for us now. So somebody has had a really good day with his finds. He keeps saying no, but he's the one that's found the two bikes. He's found the knife. He's found what else was it? There was a few other bits as well, weren't there? Well, either way, caps. A bottle caps. <laughs> but he's found the bigger stuff than I have, and the better stuff than I have. Again, just like last week when he found the piece of a gun. So we hope you enjoyed the video. Not too many finds though. But Especially, still. hope you have a um, good video because we had a new person in our video. Ah, uh, well, we had a new person with us, but he's a bit camera shy, so you won't see him in the video. You might hear him, but you won't see him. Um, so remember to, pardon me, remember to like, share, subscribe, and if you're new, please like and subscribe. So you don't miss another one of our uploads. So remember, if you're gonna stick a thumbs down, make sure you slip it into the comments the reason why you're putting the thumbs down. So remember, till next time, to stay green and enjoy yourselves. Say bye. bye. All right, so I'm back at the spot that I was at yesterday where we pulled the trial in the few bikes and everything. Um, my scrap man said he was going to be collecting, oh no sorry I was here on Sunday, it's now Tuesday. My scrap man said he was going to collect it Monday but he was too busy so he said he's collecting it today so I thought I'd quickly come down just to have a check make sure nobody's been messing with the scrap. And obviously I'm not armed with a magnet or anything where I can actually reach my scrap with. Um, so the scrap's still piled up over there but now it looks more of a mess because somebody's actually touched it. As you would know I did pull out half of the trolley yesterday. Um, somebody's actually chucked it back in but it, it's too far out for me to actually reach it um, I said obviously I'll put it back out I just don't want people coming down here thinking I've been chucking stuff back in or anything like that or been messy so I just wanted to put this in just to show you that somebody else has been down here and chucked some of it back in but majority of it's still over there so hopefully the rest of it will get collected up um, and I'll obviously I'll have to try and return at some point to get that back out again uh, so I just wanted to put it in I didn't want anybody to criticize or blame me for anything um, and when I was also saying that we've also found out hidey hole, as I call it, um, where somebody's been putting their scrap in there, the way they've been down here, that's there. Um, so I did take as much out as I could get out of here and added it to my scrap pile. Uh, and when I found the needle, that was literally, what, just down here on the floor, somewhere here. Uh, and the cap was a bit further along. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to put that on. Just don't want anybody thinking I've been leaving stuff behind or chucking anything back in. Alright, so let's talk about the ID hole. I thought I'd have a look, make sure nobody else has been down. And I found there's actually a bike stashed in there. There's the wheels. So what I think I might do, I might pull this out, pull the wheels back on, I might wheel it down the police station, get it checked. So it's another extra in for the video. Do my good fit good deed for the day. So I'll get this down the police station, might get some pictures in for you to say that I've returned it. And that's it. So there we are, been to the police station. Bikes all handed in. They'll contact me in a week or two weeks. Let me know if it's stolen or not. Uh, and they said if it's not stolen, um, they've actually said for me to just come and collect it again. So if I do, what I'll end up doing, I'll just sell it most likely or donate it to somebody that needs it. So cheers guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. And until the next time, remember, stay green.